Hello, Lola's. So hello everybody. First of all, I want to make sure that you are subscribed to my channel. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you share every video that you watch on my YouTube channel. That's how you show your support and your love to a YouTube creator is by sharing their videos and giving them thumbs up. But also guys, remember that every Sunday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, there is Dolly Court TV where we go over real cases, scammer issues, uh, yeah, no. Drama in the community within either the YouTube platform or the Facebook platform, even maybe Instagram. I don't never see much going on, on Instagram, but hey, you never know. But anyway, it's not limited to any of that. But every Sunday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Dolly Drama Court TV will be on this channel live. So come um, check us out. Um, also, I wanted to give you guys just a quick little video just to show you guys what dolls everybody asked me like what can we see your silicone collection i don't have a huge silicone collection at this time i you know may share another baby at a later date um however um i'm going to show you the three that you guys may have seen little pieces of here and there or seen a lot of um and i'll tell you guys who they are because they are sitting right here you guys know puck santana which is uh, sculpted by Lily and Briefill. Artist is unlisted um, as she does not do customs. Um, but he is my beautiful little baby, full body silicone. He ha he is poured in Equiflex 20, um, and he has the jointed neck. You guys, um, his artist uh, sculptor Lily and Briefill has babies, and they are now being poured in soft silicone. Um, so you can check out her page on Facebook, order. She does long layaways on her blankets, and there's a host of silicone artists that paint, and they usually average around $800 uh, for painting unless you go with somebody very exquisite that has a really big name, then yeah, you're going to pay probably double, triple that in painting costs, but hey, it is what it is. But um, let's move on. So I'm going to show you guys these two little love bugs over here. So, so as you guys see, you guys are familiar with Lizzie Pooh. Lizzie Pooh is the Gabby Gale by Claire Teller. She's a partial cloth body silicone baby. Um, when you say partial or cloth body, it just means that her head, her arms, and her legs are sil silicone. And the rest of the um, her body is cloth, like the reborn babies. So, um... That is her. She does have a fully open and sculpted mouth with tongue, gums, you know, the whole nine yards. Um, and she is, didn't I just say, by Claire Teller. The little one that you guys see there is my, he's more of a personal baby, so you guys probably won't see him as much. Here and there, you'll see pictures of him or see him. But he is uh, the only AA boy, um, Charles, by um, Claire Teller. He's a micro preemie. And he's full, um, he's a full body with armatures in his arms and his legs. And, you know, his little squishy belly and, um, he has a drinking wet. And he has, yeah, the same thing, the tongue, the uvula, the whole little nine yards in his little mouth, um, and gums or whatever. But, yeah, so those are my, this is my babies that I'm willing to share so far. Um, like I said, I may add add another one to share with you guys later at a later date but um i'm hoping to one day to open a I, right now all my silicone babies is sleepers so i'm hoping to one day be able to get an open eye baby again into my collection um i'm looking for a full body open eye baby because i i'm really drawn to sleepers i mean it's it's no secret those are the ones that i tend to to hold on to the longest seemed like to me. So I, that tells me that I'm more drawn to sleepers. So this is my collection. I hope and pray that God continue to bless me. I know I don't really talk religion and politics on my channel, but I do have to say that because I have to give him credit for what it is um, to be able to keep these and add to without letting them go. So um, 
Thank you guys for always supporting my choices and my babies and enjoying them with me. It does mean a lot as a collector to all that don't agree with my choices. I'm sorry. Hopefully one day I'll bring somebody in that you guys love and like. But, you know, girl, what? Unless you funding that fee. <laughs> ah, to the left, to the left. <laughs> anyway, um, thanks guys for watching again. Um, again. I, you guys know, I'm a huge Claire Teller fan. I don't know that I would add at this point any other dolls other than um, Claire Teller in my collection right now because I'm just playing it safe. I can't afford to take the risk. So that's just my, my thing right now and I'm sticking to it. So see you guys later. Bye-bye.